Hey guys, in the last video I solved this 12 piece burr puzzle. Now it's pretty easy to solve but I thought well could I make it in Lego and uh, well not quite the same size but uh, well here it is. So uh, let's uh, first of all we're gonna have to take this apart. So we'll just sort of see down here uh, we've got a couple of pieces here. Now it kind of pulls apart, but uh, it doesn't pull apart. So you have to kind of take the pieces out. Oh, hang on. That looks pretty familiar. We'll take these two pieces out to start with. And uh, then we'll flip this on its side. And we'll just take out these other pieces here. This piece here. And now the pieces will start to come out quite easily. So we take that piece off the top. And all the other pieces come out like that. So this is the 12 piece Lego burr puzzle. So if you want to see how to put this Lego burr puzzle together, well, let's do this. Okay, so putting the puzzle pieces together is pretty easy. I'm just going to show you the actual pieces because you probably don't need uh, me to actually show you. So we'll just have a look at the base here. And uh, well, we've obviously got a two by 10, so We've got a few stacks here. That's actually just a brick high, another brick, a couple of plates or tiles on top. And we've just got a plate and a tile in the middle here. So that's that piece and you'll need a two of those. Like that. Now, the next piece is very similar, uh, but this time you're actually going to have a little gap in there. So you can see that there. So we just need to use these one by plates to do that. Uh, one by fours over each side, and I've got a one by eight here with a one by two. And uh, I've actually put plates on here now. You can see here, these are actually three plates. I found that the um, gripping of plates was a lot better than actually putting blocks on. So I just put a block on top, but uh, definitely put plates on plates. And uh, again, you'll need two of those. Now we'll do a couple of easier pieces here. So this is a two by 10 plate. Uh, we've got some uh, two by two tiles on the top and just at the end here, we've got a couple of two by two plates. So it's just making a stack high there and that's equivalent to a brick. We're gonna need two of those. So we're just going to do one that's similar to that. Uh, this time we're actually going to have one more one by two here. So it's just a little bit offset, uh, but you can see that there. Again, it's a two by 10 plate at the base and it's just made a little bit differently. Now this one's pretty easy. Uh, I didn't have any two by 10 plates, but if you have them, that's great. And you're just using some plates here on the side. So we've actually got two by seven. Uh, and we're using obviously two by two by one tile there and we've got a two by one uh, gap in here as well So keep that in mind and uh, you want to finish it off with another little block on the end Okay, so now we've got these pieces these were a little bit harder to make so we're going to be using these one by plates here and uh, That's a one by ten and we've got a couple of one by fours there and then in the middle here, we're just gonna use a one by two plate, a couple of those and a tile. And we're just stepping that down by one as well, or by two actually. And we just pop a couple of these tiles on top here. So you're gonna go ahead and uh, make two of those as well. So that's the format on the bottom and that's the format on the top. So to finish off this Lego burr puzzle, you're gonna need the main base. Now, these are a little bit harder to make because uh, it's actually quite a big block. But if we just pull this apart here, you'll see it's just a two by 10 with some tiles on top. And this block here is actually a plate. It's a four by 10. Now I've made that up with just a few pieces that I had. We've got a couple of uh, blocks on the top here with tiles. And on the bottom, we've just got some more blocks and one more layer of plates. So that kind of makes that. Now, obviously you need two of those and we just join that together by pushing that down on both ends like that. So you're gonna to have to go ahead and make two of those. They might be hardest to find the pieces, but as you can see, I've got a few chunky bits there, but uh, that's pretty much it. 
So these are all the pieces you need to make your Lego bird puzzle. So we're going to go ahead and put it all together. So first of all, we're going to start with one of these bases. Uh, next, you're going to grab this piece here, and we're just going to sit it on top. Now we need to get two of these pieces, so we'll pop that onto the end here, and the other one just sits on the end over this side. Now we'll go ahead and find one of these again, and we just pop it on like that. Now we just grab this uh, base piece, and we're just put it, putting it on top just like that. Actually, it's on like that. So you can see there, it's kind of like a H shape. Now we want to go ahead and turn that up on its side, like that. And we're going to go ahead and find one of these pieces here. So we'll just pop that, turn that around here, and pop that in like that. Okay, so now the next piece we need to do is we need to pull this across a little bit. So you can see now we've got a little hole in there. And we're going to put something in that hole. So let's find this piece here. Now this is the one with the four and then the six at the end. And we're going to put the larger piece down at the bottom. Now we grab one of these pieces. This is the one with the uh, gap in the middle here. And we're going to pop that down like this. Now because the other piece is right, it actually slides over like that. So that's the start. We've got three more pieces to do. So we flip that over and we'll just turn that around. And we can see we've got some more spaces in here. So we're going to go ahead and put this other piece in. And that actually just goes in underneath here. So we'll just pull that one back a little bit and push that down. And that just sits on like that. So we're just going to go put a, this piece in now. Now if we just put this piece in by itself, that's awesome. Uh, but that won't fit in. So we actually take this piece out and you can see that this will just slot in there like that. Then when you slot that down like that, you've finished the puzzle. So that's the 12 piece Lego Burr puzzle. It's pretty easy to make and uh, you could possibly try to make it in a smaller size, but you'd have to change the puzzle. So I've sort of left it at this size here um, because well, basically, I managed to copy exactly what this one looked like. So if you like this puzzle idea, please like and subscribe. And I'm trying to get back into some more regular videos. I just haven't figured out what they are yet. So if you've got some ideas, leave them in the comments below. And until next time, it's bye for now.